up, everybody? It's your boy, k -Nighter. That was cute. Um, and so I kind of screwed up. And I tried to stream Inscription um, after playing a bit of Portal. Because uh, the plan was to play Faz, but the boys weren't ready yet. So um, I played like. I streamed like an hour of inscription on the face cam, so the whole me volume was muted, <laughs> which sucks. So, and you can't do new game, so we're just going to have to continue. Um, I will allow you to see the stream of what uh, happened or during the stream if you want to, the same time I open up this video. Okay. Um where are we? What's going on? We're gonna see squirrel dagger what I've got a basic deck. Is this the beginning? I'm thinking this is the beginning. So what do I have to play? Squirrel adder. Alright. Um, did I get all of these? Yeah, I did. Hey, bro. Take your teeth here. Alright, let's get on with it, boys. Um... The boulder kind of sounds good, actually. But, I mean, that would take up space. I don't know if I want that. Start with a normal fight. I don't know if I'm ready for a totem fight. What do I get from a totem fight? What, what's coming up here? A coyote and a coyote. Uh, but I don't want to take those hits. Luckily for me, the stoke can take it. Yeah, boxhead. I am sure. You're gonna hit. Uh, the stoat only does one damage, which is fine because coyote has one health. Squirrel. I can't do anything else. So we're just gonna take another hit, which is really not good. But. He's about to get his whole life screwed over. Boom. A lucky draw. Maybe. Alright, so next, this next one is going to be for overkill. I can't do that, so I have to go stink bug. One, one, three. Yeah, that's all I can do. Alright, I got two overkill points. That's pretty solid. Let's see the trapper. Me pelts are clean! Um, a free one. Thank you. And then the wolf pelt is all I can afford. Thank you. Thanks for your patronage! Um, that's a totem, right? I could probably use a totem. Oh, I still have the squirrel! That's sweet. The decrepit woodcarver moved towards you, or whatever. She moved with a certain vigor, in spite of her considerable age. I guess I'll go with the wolf. You hunched down the place for offering in your pack. When you looked up again, the ancient woman had vanished. <laughs> hmm. That's not quite the voice I had for him. But 
I can't really think of it right now. So, oh, lovely for me. I got a pelt. What do you got? We got coyotes that um go after the the newest, freshest meat. Um. Oh, that's a spider. Okay. Um, and I really don't want to take that hit, so bullfrogs and butterflies it is. Boom, boom, and I just got hit hard. Oh, no, I kind of messed up, but, uh, hopefully it's fine. Chill. Chill. Is in fact not fine. But oh, <laughs> oh well. Oh, it's only one life, right? <clears throat> we can, we can still do this. When will a worthy challenger appear? I don't know, man. But you, you've chosen for the wrong guy. You encountered a small outpost in the woods, tendered by a mysterious woman. It was the traitor that the old trapper had mentioned. Her appearance was unsettling, but you were mollified by her offerings. Do you mind if I examine those pelts of yours? Oh, for sure. Let's start with your hair pelts. Here's what I can offer. I can trade you any of these. Take your time. Okay, uh, the adder is what I need to be able to play. What's the beaver do? Uh, oh yeah, the dam builder. I don't want that. What's that? Um, move in the direction inscribed on the sigil. Will be pushed in the same direction. Oh, wow. Not sure I want that. Um, what's this? The creature that you own perishes by combat. A card bearing the sigil in your hand is automatically played. And it's place. Okay, that's interesting. I don't know if that's a good play though. And then this is the mirror thing that I think that was like a mirror's their health is his damage or something, which is really good. Oh Wolf Pelt too Exquisite Oh I'm, I get extra sigils. Sweet. Um, oh, another mirror one that gets more powerful by the turn. Coyote, that when it dies, it gives it four bones, which means I would actually not... Yeah, it's not very... I don't know. Um, Rat King with flight defense? Wait, what's this? When a card bearing the sigil is played, you may search your deck for any card and take it into your hand. That sounds pretty darn good, but I don't have that big of a deck right now, so I'm I'm thinking about the Bloodhound. Bloodhound was pretty good last time. These pelts are most exquisite, excellent. My thanks. I think I screwed up her voice, but oh well. Um, uh, let's 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 give someone a power up, you know. I'm feeling power up time. Oh hi. The warm light of a campfire was a welcome sight, though the ten hungry eyes around it dampened the greeting. Warm a creature by the fire, enhance its power, said one. Of course I will do that. Um, let's go with... But Stow, you are like... The card that I could really use to enhance. I guess I'll go with the Bloodhounds. Because I guess with that double hit, that's going to be a really good card. Why not warm the, by the creature by the fire for just a moment longer? One of the starving survivors took a step closer. This would be risky. Absolutely, let's go for it. Luck was on your side. Perhaps one more moment? <laughs> yeah, let's not be pushing our luck any further. The survivors were right about the flame. They had enhanced the creature's power. Spotting a few of the survivors drooling, you made a hasty retreat with your bloodhound. Well, good for me. I've got a really superbly powerful bloodhound now. 
Um, the only problem is, is that it's going to go in and challenge one opponent and then hit the side. Also, that's sparrows. Um, how do you combat a sparrow? You do a mirror. I don't know. Oh, does it just mirror the damage? Back on the board! Oh, you both do one damage. That's not- Oh, I'm dead! I was- I- I didn't- Oh, I didn't notice I'd been hit before. Oh, okay. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's not my first death. No, it's not even close. Your death card. Beautiful. Though it could use some detail. Choose a card to draw the cost from. Uh, or, no, I shouldn't have done that, because then I could have got the power from the Bloodhound. Ah, darn shucky roots. Alright, the cost of two blood from the Bloodhound. This will enhance its power and health. I guess we're going three health, no power, from the Mirror Tentacle. You may choose a card from the Extract Sigils. The, sign, so the Sigil of Mighty Leap from the Bolt. I never did ask your name. I think this is Teenider 5. Ugh. But there is only one last thing to do. Stay still. <laughs> that will be all. Love you. Good picture. Alright. Dang it! <laughs> I died so quickly there. Ah. Uh. Uh, if you saw the stream, you know I have, like, two or three cards that are no cost, and a lot of power, or a lot of health, or whatever, and that seems really OP, and I wish I could get one of those. Sometimes I wish I hadn't done away with Grimora. Uh, she, at least, was a worthy opponent. Your pitiful deck. Dude, I hate this deck. With the voice crack and everything. <laughs> Woo! This sucks. The magpie. It can fetch any card in your deck. For two blood, though. Uh, this is just a random, so I don't know if I want that. The real moose. Creatures of the wild make way for it. I guess I'll go add her. Cause, uh, wait, no! Hold on, did that change? I, should, I, I gotta go check. It did change. It's a mantis now. Uh, what was in this corner? There was absolutely something in that corner there. One, two, three, four. Oh, I screwed up counting that, so we're just not going to do it then. Oh, hey, look at that. I got some teeth on my side. Good stuff. You're angry. Blow out your candles. <gasps> oh, I got a card from it this time! I do relish snuffing out your excess candles before a boss. Perhaps you will now enjoy it as much as I do. Oh, was it because of the, I summoned the Bone Lord beforehand? Was that it? I don't know. Let's go for the totem, man. Because I need a good totem. Could you imagine if I got, like, a uh, unkillable squirrel? That would be so good. You came upon the old woodcarver, who fixed her intense gaze upon you. After an overlong moment of silence, she moved to offer her cradle. It's better with every turn. Uh, I don't know about that for a squirrel, or a flying squirrel. I guess better with every turn? I don't know. Alright. A gray-haired woman silently collected her carvings and left. Well, let's go fight with my squirrels that get better if they survive a turn. Great draw, thanks. 
Okay, what do we got coming up? A wolf cub. Oh, that's perfect for stinky, but it won't be stinky this turn. All right, bullfrog. Show them what you got. Show them what you're made of. Look at my hair. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's go with the squirrel. I think I can take care of that. Or stink bug. Bullfrog. But I'm gonna go with that. Maybe. Boom! Bo oh, how lovely. Did I neglect to mention overkill damage? Excess damage is not wasted. It carries over to the card behind the mangled corpse of the victim. Lucky for you. Yeah, that, you know, honestly, that is pretty darn lucky for me. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, buddy, you're about to get yourself slapped. Uh, stinky. Well, I, I guess that's all I can do, so. No! Oh, I put the stink bug in the worst spot. I didn't even... Mm, this is why I, I just can't win this game. What is that? Um, An altar. I don't have enough cards. I need more cards. I just need a good card. That's what I need. That skunk actually looks pretty good. 205! This is the one I just had! Oh, it mirrors damage! <gasps> The Undying Cat and the Elf. Oh, t or 5, I am going to have to strongly pass on you. <laughs> but oh well. <laughs> oh, hey, my, did my items carry over? I don't know. Um, since I have the Emergency Squirrel, the Emergency Black Goat just pairs along with it so well. Also, I don't know if I need that dagger because I don't want to use it. Probably cutting off a finger and I don't want to cut off my finger. I've called it. What, what just happened? Okay, we've got the Undying Squirrel. Um. Or not squirrel. Cat. Which means I can do this, 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 boom, boom, boom. Boom. Oh, uh, yeah. I guess I go for the adder here to decrease damage. You're gonna die there. Alpha's coming up on the cat, which is not ideal. Um, but what you gonna do? Alpha kills my cat, which sucks, and I d I don't die. I have emergency squirrel, which is oh yes sir. I do not. I shouldn't have to use this stuff now, but. The adder should be able to counter the alpha's one damage, meaning I should live another day. Which is a good thing. Or not. Hopefully this is a bone. Ew! That was a great job. Yes, I think you've got me this time. Oh, I think so too. But we are going for the overkill, baby. We're going for the big overkill on you. And I have enough bones... So I just go for the stoat, does one damage. So as much as the adder. Uh, so we just leave it like that. Oh! oh! Oh, the overkill you're about to feel! Woo! Yeah, baby! That was some good overkill, if I don't say so myself. If I don't say so myself, and I don't say so myself. Ah, the diligent ant. Its strength is proportioned to its, the size of its colony. The meddlesome bat, a minor terror. Um, actually, that's pretty good. And then the tenacious skink, when being attacked, leaving it. So, did we already do that one? But I'm thinking, Teenider, the inevitable knight. They will lurch forth from your hand when creatures are killed. Dang, no teenager. 
Well, I'm gonna go with the maggots, and because I don't actually have to spin the five bones on them, I just hold them in my hand. Form a creature by the fire, enhance its health, sort of hungry survivor. Absolutely. Um. Ooh, cat. That's a really good idea. Surely your creature could become more powerful, but you would need to risk another moment by the fire. Not with my cat. I don't want it to have five health. That would not be good. Three is three is so that it can take one hit. I do not want it taking five hits. That would not be good. The health of the cat was enhanced by the war. As one of the survivors began pulling a knife from your pocket, you withdrew. Alright, let's go into battle with a better cat this time. Um, okay. Um, oh, a mole and a, a pronghorn. Oh, interesting. Okay. Um, so, those pronghorns are going to come here, attack, and then move to the right. It does one damage, so I don't think I need to be too worried about it right away. Actually, it does two damage because that's how attacks work. So I'm going to put the bullfrog over here. And then I can sacrifice the bullfrog in the future, get my stink bug, and then that will take care of the pronghorn. So I'm only taking one hit now, which is good. And now... Uh, sacrifice you for you, I guess. I don't know. Put the stink bug there. You're doing no damage now. Boom, boom. Crap, though, I forgot the pronghorn moves and I grabbed the wrong thing. So we're just going to have to survive with this for now. Oh, that was a good shot. Good job, pronghorn. That was good, good by you. Well, is that an elk fawn? Um, you're gonna die. Get rid of the pronghorn. Boom. 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 Alphon does one damage. And, oh, it's already taken care of. Beautiful. And then I think after this turn, it's probably just uh, set up for overkill, which is beautiful. Scoop. I don't know what that means. Oh, you're giving up. Okay. Um,. Unfortunately for you, not quite how this one works. Uh, maggots only do one. That's going to... Oh, that's not going to kill him. Which is absolutely beautifully perfect in every way. What is my last card? I think it's the Undying Cat. Which is not exactly ideal right now. I don't have enough bones. Dang. Oh well. It's still a good, good overkill, so we should be fine. Um I don't have any pelts, so I don't think that's gonna help me. Okay, let's see. The Raven. Oh, I actually need the mantis. But I'm not gonna care about that as much as getting better. I'll take that card, I guess. Items. Yes, please. I have no items. Um, ooh, ooh, I need to start running bones more often. I'll go with the bones, and I'll go with the boulder, because that's probably going to happen with the prospector, where I'll just need uh, a protection turn. I have smoke. That's uh, smoke. It is great indeed. The trees closed in tight around you. Creating an impenetrable brush. The only way out was forward, and the hobbled shape of a man stood in that way. Got any gold in that there skull? Let me crack it open and take a look. A lot of energy, bro. Easy, boss. Pop the mule. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Um. The squirrel is going to grow into a better form. Maybe 
Maybe that's a strategy. Maybe I just run with the squirrel, you know? I think I'm gonna run stoat. Um, attacking the of that guy for now. Taking the taking the hit from the coyote. Enough. You're already hurt. Yeah, I know. Um. No. Uh... All right. Um. Okay. Now we put the wolf on the pack mule. And then we have a whole bunch of bones too, which is gonna be helpful, hopefully. Boom boom, wolf cub. Oh, that's that. All right. Well, that kind of sucks, but not really, because I can just play a squirrel here, get that bullfrog on the table to take out the wolf cub. And oh, this is actually playing out really well for me right now. You coward! That mule was defenseless. I don't know. That was probably not the best. Okay, I got a beaver, I got a... Okay. I got... Well, give me a second. Okay. There we go. Um, that hand thing, um, which might be the, like, your health is my hit, I don't know. And the cockroach, which is a really good card, uh, since I have so many bones. Um, that wolf is gonna hit the wolf, and I don't really want that. There ain't too much I can do about it. Um, I already have a squirrel and a cockroach, so I don't think I need that right now. Oh, well, corpse! That's actually pretty good. Boom, 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 boom. Oh! Oh, it played out perfectly! Nice, guys! There's gold in them cards! And now they're all... Corpses are in no short supply! Oh, my corpses went up there. That's okay. And the bloodhound, which is gonna go after this for now. Which should be fine. Oh, the adder. That's going to be helpful. Um. Alright, that's it. That's. I don't have to worry about this turn. Yeah! Okay, uh. Let's go with this again. The, oh, the cat. That'll be helpful. I don't know if I want to play him right. Yeah, let's play him right now. That blood is going to be annoying if I can't do something about it. Fortunately for me, I can't. Oh, yes! Oh, that's such a good card! Oh, wow! Alright, you're dead. Oh, the adder. Well, that's nothing to worry about. The ringworm? It says it doesn't do anything, it only has one health, so I don't know what that does. Um. All of you guys do one. Uh, I was kind of hoping for some overkill, but I don't think I'm going to get any. It's fine. It's just the dam. Oh well, that's fine. I beat you, Prospector! <clears throat> Pretty impressive. Me, yeah, I don't got this up. Need need a light. Your reward. Strange larvae, a largely unimpressive specimen. Mole man, the amorphous amoeba. Its sigils are ever changing. Oh, oh, but that's only two bones. So I am taking that for dinner. Free of the prospector's unhinged gaze, you look forward. Let me think. As the air grew humid, your boots become hard to pull from the mud. 
The dank smell of tepid air and water invaded your nostrils. You had reached the wetlands. All right, please give me a good card. T Nighter? Woo! That's a T Nighter. Um, yeah, I don't really want any of those. <gasps> Another T Nighter. An actually solid T Nighter. Let's go. You know, I'm down for it. I want my OG back. That's okay. Oh, I could upgrade him, too. <clears throat> what? Oh, I didn't really mean to do this, but I need that Bantus, yeah. So I gotta figure out what this is. Where's the little one? Um. Alright. Oh, wait. No, no, no. I pressed the wrong button. Oh, uh, let's see what's my deck here. Um. I could extract a, a sigil. <gasps> Ooh, can I extract the, like, amoeba and put it on, say, like, the stoat or the cat? That might be good. Although, I want to keep the amoeba because it has two bones. So, even if a uh, sigil is bad. It would still be useful as, like, as a, you know, one damage, two health card. So, I don't think I'm going to go with the... Oh, items, and then you get a totem battle card thing. Mushroom. Did I ha I think I saw the mushroom in the stream, but I don't remember what it does. I'm going to upgrade my, my stuff, because I don't need items. The crackling fire lit the starving faces of a group of survivors. Alright. We have not food, one said. But perhaps one of your creatures will join us. Enhance its health. Its health? Um... I gotta, I gotta upgrade my, my, my main man, t -Nighter. Keep it right there, said one survivor. The creature could become more powerful. The survivors looked hungrier by the second. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. The health of Teenager 1 was enhanced by the warmth. As one of the survivors began pulling a knife from their pocket, you withdrew. Oh no, I meant to upgrade that a second time. Oh well. Alright. Yep. Alright, I'm going to end this one right here. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching this episode. Uh, I... I'm still upset at myself over the failure of the voice crack, um, of the stream fail. So, we will, I don't know, tell me in the comments if you guys want to see more of this or not. I want to play more, so if you guys don't want to see it, then I just won't record it and I'll play it by myself. If you guys do want to see it, uh, want to see more, you know, I'll keep making more. Um, because, yeah, I can understand why you wouldn't want to watch, you know, an hour long um, stream with me muted, just playing Inscription and losing like four times. So, I guess that's up to you. Um, anyways. I will see all of you guys in my next video. I'm sure you'll all be there. Have a good day, guys. Make sure you like the video. You're subscribed. Comment. Because honestly, I love it when you guys comment. I think that's so fun to interact with viewers. And like, you know, I and feedback. I love feedback. I've always liked feedback. I've always liked being coached. Um... Because that, that's what makes you better, is being told you're doing something wrong. Um, so yeah, I will see all of you in the next video.